I don't want something happen to me someday and suddenly receive the notice saying your daughter has gone. Hi, my name is Helen. I train at Enterprise Business. The last time I went back to China was about like three years ago. I was like, this week. <laughs> yes. And my parents, they always talk about like, can you just do some exercise? I didn't really take that serious. In 2016 and 2017, I tend to have a lot of fever or cold and it went for a long period. I had infections a lot. It ended up at the end of 2016, I was in hospital for like two days and the swollen didn't really shrink. And the doctor said, okay, then this is the time we need to schedule our surgery. My cousin says uh, she passed away in London and I knew that you just don't want to die in overseas, that's it. You just couldn't do anything to get her back. My parents, they didn't really contact with me every day, kind of like normal Chinese parents. I don't want something happen to me someday and suddenly receive the notice saying your daughter has gone already. I started to look at, okay, maybe I need to get some change. And I just Googled Melbourne personal trainers and enterprise came up. I'm Tyler, I'm a senior coach at Enterprise and I train Miss Helen. Initially Helen, she was about 100 kilos. She wasn't really eating despite her size, like she was eating two meals a day. Quite anxious, sleep was very poor, sleeping four to five hours a night. Training at Enterprise not only helped me to have the healthy lifestyle, also helped me with my immune system. Because these days in winter, no matter how weather changed, I don't get cold. I've never met someone who's so keen to get to the gym and train herself, so it's massive hats off to her. One night she showed me her diary and it's handwritten and she's got pictures. She even had pictures of myself from videos that I'd filmed previously. Once I saw that, it really got my heart behind it, knowing how much she was putting into it. I could see the results coming out. When I went back to China, I already lost 22 kilos. My parents was like, I knew you were going to lose weight, but I just didn't expect you losing that much. She said, like, getting slim is not the purpose. The purpose is getting healthy.